Welcome! You're watching the thrift store on Dad of the Leaping Hollywood Homer on a budget. Today is all about getting in touch with our inner artist as we discover the art of thrifting. And like almost every themed week we do, it starts in the kitchen. And oh boy, when it starts in America's Test Kitchen, all aboard who's going aboard? There's certainly not much to be bored with with this one. Boards. With food styling and expert advice by one of ATK's leading entertainers, expert food stylist and cast member, L. Simone Scott. This was picked up for 20% off the retail prices of 30 bucks in the U.S., 35 bucks in Canada. I actually vlogged my purchase, so if you want to check that out, I went to the Clifton comments. I also went to Chevy's Fresh Bets, and I'll link that in the description below. Anyway, I'm so you're quite familiar with those grazing boards you see at a lot of parties. So colorful, so stylish, appetizing on every level for the eyes and the taste buds. They're quite literally edible works of art. A great way to get in touch with your inner artist. Even if you can't paint worth anything, you can certainly carry your inner Jurassic Pollock on a board of any size, any shape, for any occasion. That's why the tagline says, stylish spreads for casual gatherings. This is El Simone Scott, by the way. You know, it's still Black History Month, right? And I have it on good authority that one of these sports should work well if you're having a viewing party for, I don't know, the NAACP Image Awards every tonight across the entire Paramount Network spectrum. Anyway, let's take a trip to ATK's boarding school for a top-tier education on stylish breads for casual gatherings. Now, before you go ham on the themed boards around here, and by the way, one of the key elements to a great board is creating a theme for each board. You gotta know the three basic boards first. A cheese board, a charcuterie board, a board with lots of meat, and a crudite platter. That's a board with lots of veggies. You'll learn how to assemble those boards in this basic section here, which begins the book. You also know how to section out in each attractive space the ingredients that's called for for a lot of the boards in here. We have a mix of store-bought items and homemade, made-from-scratch stuff to fill in the gaps and often take set of stage. You also know how to treat each essential component with care for assembling these boards. All the basic tips, tricks, and techniques you'll find in the beginning chapter here, which is called... Get on board. Cheese, charcuterie, and more. You'll learn what is a board to begin with, and how you can let your imagination run wild afterwards. So those are your crudités. This is your charcuterie board. And this is your cheese board. Three essential boards to know about, all serving six to eight. The majority size range for a good number of these boards. From there, we go to the themed boards, and we have here four board chapters. Let's begin with a Bloody Mary bar, which serves six to eight. When was the last time I talked about Bloody Mary? Bloody Mary! Bloody Mary! Ah! Yikes! Way too much of this sauce. Better them than me. Anyway, it's a mixture of store-bought stuff and homemade Bloody Marys for a crowd. You have here key strategies to follow for assembling your board, and beyond L strategies, you really go ham and decide with any which way you choose. These are just good guidelines to follow. Plus, leveling up your board with homemade offerings, like black pepper candied bacon, herb rim salt for salting the rims of your cocktail glasses, or beer glasses, these regular glasses, whatever your heart desires, plus a variation for sriracha rim salt to really spice up your Bloody Mary. So this is definitely a brunch board, even though we're in the breakfast chapter. Next up, Movie Night, which serves four to six. Hey, Movie Night is a thing, according to Al Simone Scott. So, why not commemorate that subtle yet crucial distinction with a snack of palooza Salty, buttery, no kernel left unpopped popcorn, and all the candy you can dream about. Movie night is most certainly a thing, no matter what occasion that it calls for. Hey, come on, this weekend, it's gonna be a big thing, no matter what. So you must level up with these offerings. 
Here we have a pizza parlor board, which serves four to six. You start with French bread pizza, and from there, you can spread it out with classic pizza toppers, such as parmesan, red pepper flakes, dried oregano, and granulated garlic. If you want, you can level up by adding a Greek salad and garlic butter dipping sauce, plus a spicy honey drizzle and a balsamic drizzle. So many tips, techniques, and time-tested advice can be found here in these sidebars and little squares, like building your own pizza toppings and other essential ingredient techniques for crafting these edible works of art. I have to say, this ties the movie night for my favorite boards in the book. And we don't stop there. Beyond the breakfast and lunch, well, lunch and dinner boards in the bring your appetite section, we also have dessert boards like ice cream sundaes. Four to six, you start with ice cream, sprinkles, load on the toppings, and if you want, you can level up with salted butterscotch sauce and a mixed berry coolie. Plus more toppings and even store-bought waffles and bananas. Ice cream and pizza. I don't care what season you're in or what season you prefer, that is a combo made in heaven. It doesn't take a genius or anybody walking at ATK who's a special genius to remember that. From an Oktoberfest board to a regular picnic board to a day at the ballpark, Breakfast, lunch and dinner, and desserts, you'll definitely want to bring your appetite and your inner Monet. Turn having people over into a casual affair and make it look good too. Join professional food stylist, ATK cast member, and entertaining enthusiast El Simone Scott as he shares her tips for creating photo worthy spreads, letting you in on trade secrets ranging from plating techniques to how she keeps things looking fresh on set and all party lawn. Across 35 boards, you'll find over 150 of ATK's foolproof recipes to build your board around, or add that special homemade touch from a platter worthy steak frites to better than store bought dips and everything in between when it comes to your party and see an ATK inspired grazing board of any kind or a buffet or spread and this book tells you how to differentiate between the three you're not gonna feel bored at all I'd say 4.5 out of 5 this is one board of education I think you'll have no trouble devouring and one more time for the people in the back bloody Mary bloody Mary bloody Mary <laughs> Delicious! Thanks for watching TSR! Now, to see another awesome review like this one, click here! If you want to become a Hollywood bargain hunter, click here to subscribe! Now, catch you on the thrift side!